There are strong indications that the Adamawa state government stands the risk of losing a whopping sum of $2.5 million World Bank Special Grant under its State Fiscal Transparency, Accountability and Sustainability Program for Resorts if the current efforts to grant executive status for board members of the State Board on Public Procurement is anything to go by. Under this program, the World Bank had proposed an amendment in the state public procurement law to grant complete independence for the State Bureau of Public Procurement. Details in this report. Since 2019, the state had enjoyed such interventions amounting to billions of naira as a reward for compliance to open government partnership as indicators for gauging government transparency and accountability drive. But in a letter to the Speaker of the House, Governor Amado Fintory requested for an amendment of the bill to grant executive status for chairman and three non-official members of the State Board on Public Procurement as against the World Bank recommendations. Already, the request has killed through the first reading, expected to be granted accelerated hearing for passage any time soon. There are fears that if it kills through, the state may lose the grant, coming at a time it needed more of such interventions. After moving the motion, the Speaker asked members if the bill would go well with them. The members unanimously agreed with the motion. After the seating, the mover of the motion was contacted to understand his rationale. This bill, there are some members, they are temporarily serving on that uh, bureau. Mm. Okay. But due to the responsibility and the importance of the bureau, His Excellency did it fit for these people to serve as permanent members. members. Okay. That is three members to be appointed. That is, they were non-ex-official mm. members. But they are now going to serve as full-time members. Also speaking on the implications of the proposed amendments, an Abuja-based procurement expert who is also a member of the committee which framed the law under the World Bank, Abdul Mamun, said the action will drift the state backwards as against its current ranking as a model in the country. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.